This is part two of my latest project, my own 8-bit game and gaming console, all built from scratch. For the display, I wanted to use a 7-inch 800x480 LCD. The AT Mega 1284 isn't powerful enough to drive this display, so I used an RA8875. Think of this like a small graphics card. You send rendering commands over SPI, and the card handles the rest. The RA8875 supports up to two graphical layers with 8 bits per pixel, which allowed me to implement double buffering. I used line strips to draw most objects because it was fast. Other effects use points, circles, or rectangles. I wanted to maintain a frame rate of about 30 frames per second. I designed each game object on paper. It was important to keep vertex count low. While a scripted campaign would not have been impossible, the AT Mega 1284 only has 128 kilobytes of flash memory. So, I implemented endless level-based play with waves of difficulty, plus an optional tutorial. There's even a high score table stored in EEPROM, so it'll persist even if you turn the console off. Stay tuned for part 3, where I'll cover audio.